this video, we will reveal seven of the hottest and most recent restaurants that have opened in Savannah. So whether you are craving the most succulent stone crab, the juiciest ribeye, or a hot and gooey cinnamon roll, feel free to make use of our list. Number seven, Two Tides Crispy. Hey, burger enthusiasts, when in Savannah, you've got to check out this food stand, hands down the best smash burger joint in town. The crispy edges, gooey cheese, and perfect pickle to onion ratio make it a top tier experience. The staff is not just friendly, but treats you like family, adding a warm touch to your visit. Located conveniently near fun activities, it's a great spot after exploring the town or catching a show at Starland Yard. However, the downside is the wait time, averaging around 15 to 20 minutes. But trust me, the incredible burger is worth it. If only they accepted online orders in advance to skip the wait, that would be a game changer. Number six, Cafe Toreo. This new cafe and coffee shop is an absolute delight. The staff is not only incredibly friendly, but also offers helpful recommendations. The raspberry lincer is definitely a must try, and the lattes are not only delicious, but also adorned with creative designs. The cafe's atmosphere, food, drink, and friendliness all score a perfect 10 out of 10. The assortment of unique items for purchase adding an extra layer of enjoyment. Although their food choices are somewhat limited, what they do have is incredibly delicious. Two of my favorites include the ham and cheese croissant and the blueberry scone. All in all, this is a must-visit spot in town, combining a fun atmosphere, delicious treats, and friendly service. Number 5. Sobre Mesa. Sobre Mesa and trendy Starland District new hotspot. The early 70s decor and friendly service create an inviting ambiance that enhances the overall dining experience. The standout feature is the impressive wine selection, boasting 18 different reds from around the world, curated with the precision of a sommelier. The small bites and charcuterie board are equally delightful, with flavors that pair exquisitely, like the 20-year tawny port with a light and lemony ricotta cheesecake. While Sobremesa is renowned for its wines, the surprise lies in the well-thought-out selection of craft beers, providing options for all palates. The only minor drawback might be the nostalgic decor, but overall, Sobremesa is a definite 1010, offering an impeccable dining experience in Savannah's vibrant culinary scene. Number 4. Dottie's. Your high standards are not only fulfilled, but exceeded at Dottie's Cafe, a quaint location that comes highly recommended. Every meal, from salads to sandwiches and pastries, is an unforgettable experience because to its generous amounts and mouth-watering flavors. It's all the more charming because of the attentive and kind personnel, which makes your visit enjoyable. A delightful and healthful diversion from Southern food, Dottie's Cafe is a downtown Savannah treasure. You should definitely go there for an amazing experience you won't soon forget. Number three, Strange Bird. Discovering Strange Bird in Savannah for lunch was a fantastic find. The revamped diner-style spot boasts a beautiful, cozy interior that adds to its unique charm. The food is exceptional. We tried an assortment and were pleased with every bite. The friendly staff made our experience even better, guiding us through the menu with enthusiasm. The only drawback was the restroom location, a bit of a trek outside, though impeccably clean. Despite this, the tacos, especially with added greens, were excellent, the service was top-notch, and the banana pudding was the perfect sweet ending. Number two, the common thread. Savannah's common thread exceeded our expectations and remains the high point of our weekend. The restaurant's warmth and friendliness, housed in a magnificent old house, create the perfect atmosphere for an unforgettable dining experience. A wide variety of flavors were available from the comprehensive menu, all of which highlighted the freshness of the ingredients. The cantaloupe dish did not live up to the expectations, even though the private room on the second floor provided a cozy touch. The superb meal and service, particularly the roasted pork tenderloin and pork belly, made up for the slightly higher price point. Unquestionably, one of the best options in Savannah, Common Thread provides more than just a meal. It's a culinary adventure we can't wait to partake in again. Number 1. Brochu's Family Tradition Entering Brochu's is a delightful experience. It's the crispiest, non-greasy fried chicken you've ever had. The chicken meal would easily feed three or four people, and the salted biscuits with honey butter are delicious. Another dish you should definitely try is the banana pudding. The menu is minimal but highlights their experience with items like freshly cooked squash and a delightfully crispy edged burger. But some customers might be disappointed by the small selection of vegetarian options. Nevertheless, Brochu's is unique in Savannah, providing a fine dining experience distinguished by its flawless service, laid-back atmosphere, and mouth-watering cuisine. 
In conclusion, as you can clearly see, each of these new establishments bring a wide range of tastes and sensations to Savannah's culinary scene. If you have ever been to Savannah, we would also love to hear your recommendations, and I am sure our viewers do too. You can leave your recommendations in the comment section at the end of this video. Also feel free to like and subscribe to The Trip Companion for more great content. With that being said, thanks for watching and have a blessed day.